up guys welcome back to the channel so we're on the way to king of the hammers koh as some of you guys might know different names same place so really cool event if you guys have never been there a lot of different things so there's um, you know last man standing back doors crazy crazy time to watch depending on what class is running and stuff too so if you guys don't know those terminologies we'll show you guys today uh, i know there's a utv race going on but uh, we're on the way now and we left early this morning to go out there to shoot with BFG as soon as we get there. So we have a couple vehicles, one Pro XP four seater, as you guys know, it's called the Mint. It's what we call it. Um, so it's four seat Pro XP with long travel, uh, BFG tires, metal fax wheels, um, got all the good stuff on that car. So we're shooting that car with them in the morning and until about midday. Then we also have our Jeep JL, so that has full evil, uh, long travel or full evil long arm kit uh, dcd finished up the jeep for us and uh so we're on the way to shoot with that too so big schedule events today try to cover as much as we can got a lot of content planned and a lot of stuff to cover so i know uh players is out there doing their demo tours and stuff if you guys aren't familiar with that that's a really cool thing because they allow anyone to pretty much drive of age of course uh to drive one of their vehicles so if you've never driven a razor before you get a chance to drive it so that's a pretty cool experience and opportunity so we're going to try to see if we can get josh in one josh has never driven um a razor in general so he'll have a chance to drive that and maybe even drive a pro r turbo r looking forward to the whole event and um, we'll show you guys as much as we can i'm not sure the limitations of bfg and the stuff that we have planned with them what we can show you so um sorry for if we missed anything good but um hopefully you see some photos and stuff of that too so stay tuned and uh let's take you guys there So now we're afternoon, so we didn't get a chance to show you guys all the stuff that we we're doing for BFG. Unfortunately, we can have the camera on and, and film. So um, it's, it's what a time is it, like four? It's like four o'clock now. So we're gonna run through Hammertown. Uh, there's a bunch of industry people, brands and stuff with their rigs, so many rigs and new products and stuff. So we're gonna sh check that out and show you guys what they have on display. So. Uh, start making our way over there and see what they got. So if you guys saw in the last vlog, we actually just finished up Pro Eagles uh, Honda Talon. So it's out here on display at their booth. So if you guys are out here, definitely stop by and say hi. But uh, it has our full graphics kit. That just shows you some of the abuse that the graphics take. But uh, when he gets home, he'll just be able to watch it and be good to go. So it'll be like, brand new again. So that's the kind of stuff that we that we do as far as durability testing. Because we're always out here in the elements. So pretty cool yeah. stuff out here that we've wrapped before. So keep making our way and see what we find. So over there, you didn't have a belt. New arms from HDR over here. And a brand new Pro R. Looks like they got upper mounts. Upper control arms here, stock lower, but looks like they got some stuff in the works. Happy now? Yeah, big time. 
it recording? I'll let you Did I stop? Are you are? I am recording. Nice. Now that Josh got his pro R experience, we didn't even get to record that because we're so hungry we're eating. I got a little, uh, I got some footage. Did you? Yeah. Your cell phone? Yeah. It's coming in clutch with that iPhone 13. Why is it a 12? Yeah. iPhone 12? Hey, you want me to hold that water for you? I got this. You mean your water? Yeah, yeah. I, I gave you my water brand new. You were drinking yours. Did you not like, oh, this feels new? Look, you just look. fucking. You gave me the exact same water. I told you just to hold it. Yeah, but it's not like I mean, you can feel it opening. No, it was open. You gave it to me and it was open. I didn't drink it. That doesn't mean it wasn't open. <laughs> but they opened it at the store. No, you, you just, know. you're getting distracted. Too many, you know, <laughs> too many people around for you. One of those I'm pretty sure I, I know the exact one. I should try to get here. Well, you know what? Because you, you're like, oh, this is still no, new. Let me just, open it. No, because when I drank it, I was like, the first is this one mine? But it was too late. Yeah. So I was just like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is, now, yeah, you have two waters. So, uh, play with Ranger. This one a kid? Hey, I'm go. good, thank you though. So proper, dude. You gotta go with the jokes. I was being, I, that was a joke. Like, no, thank you. I do want his kid. <laughs> like, no, thank you, sir. Like, what the fuck? That's what's funny about it. It's like, I just actually, like, was like, no, I'm good. Like, what if I said yes? Well, I think you're more weird. <laughs> See, you see what happens when I hold the camera, we just have these like good conversations. I know, that's what I'm saying, because when I was trying to hold it out, it felt like, and everybody was looking at me. I literally, for the one time I went out with it, I knew somebody, and he was like, oh yeah, dude, oh yeah. <laughs> this case with a camera does that. Dude, I know, I was, when I was doing time lapses earlier, there was this dude in this Ranger, and this guy held it on the rev limit for literally <laughs> 10 seconds. There we are. How cold is it? It says on the dash right there. 54. Hey, you got like a sun on here. It's the sun. That was the other part that we're The always... sun's not making it 72 in here. <laughs> no, because it comes in and the heat comes just... Yeah, I'm, you know, I'm not gonna buy that one at all. So while we're out at BFG shoot this morning, there's some people walking by, checking out the Jeep and asking what's on it. So figured to talk about it real quick. We're gonna do a full breakdown video on, on the Jeep. Starting off, we got a lot of the parts from four wheel parts. So we definitely wanna thank them. Uh, as it is, it's hard to get parts, you know, this day and age. So uh, starting off, we got Dana 60 axles, front and rear. That's a big step from the uh, factory stock axles. So I would say that's a definitely an important piece. Moving on to suspension, so we have coilovers all the way around the entire Jeep with triple bypasses in the front. So this is the Evo double throw down long, uh, long arm kit from them, um, as well as their front inner fenders. So kind of cool how it ties all that stuff and leaves a decent amount of shock exposed because that's a cool factor and everybody notices that. So we got, I think these are CRC sliders up front uh, or on the sides. And then we just got some two fenders that we powder coated black. Um, in the front of it, this is a Poison Spider front bumper with their winch plate. So the winch is kind of tucked up in there like that is keeps the jeep kind of low profile in the front they want something really big so and same thing in the rear so we have matching poison spider rear bumper with a built-in tire carrier so these are talking about tire carrier talking about tires these are the kmc uh wheels we went with this uh regular machine finished and they're dirty right now but this is a powder coated black ring we went black accents black lug nuts in the center and then um so going back to the tire carrier it supports the 39 inch pfg km3 um, tire and it swivels here on this uh, back bumper a lot of little things done to it but those are the big things so i just want to kind of talk through that stuff but uh, definitely the Jeep wouldn't be possible without DCD Customs. They're actually local to our shop in Chatsworth. So they do a lot of a lot of nice Jeeps, a lot of Hemi swaps as well. Definitely recommend them. They take care of all our Jeep stuff and just wanna thank them for getting the Jeep done and be out here because 
it was a struggle to get parts and stuff and these guys made it happen so if you're not following them follow them on instagram um, i think they have a youtube channel too but uh we'll uh put a link in the description below too, too for them day's kind of winding down i mean you can see it's getting uh starting to get dark but uh we're gonna go keep cruising around and uh, i'll show you guys the next location <laughs> <laughs>